Colorists and Colorists. And I'm sure we have some new viewers to Bricado, so welcome, welcome, welcome. And I know we also have some viewers who have been here before, so welcome back to those of you who have been on one of our webinars um, previously. So we just really want to cover, we're going to cover a lot in the next 90 minutes. So, and some of the information we will also share with you after the webinar, we will be sending you some information as well. So, you know, if you're a note taker, we, we will move a little quickly, but yet at the same time, everything will be here on the screen and we'll also be able to send you some further information after the webinar. So, um, the first thing we wanted to talk about is why Bricado Color Project. And I'm going to cover some of our unique points of difference, but at the same time, in just a moment, I'm going to go into each one in a little bit more detail. So first of all, form, formulated by San Bricado. Second is that we're brand new. The color is brand new and it was built from the ground up. We have used German technology, but yet we are American made. It is hairdresser driven, created by a stylist for stylists. Our low ammonia odor or LAO as we call it, we're very proud of that. The color has a conditioning base for healthy uncompromised hair. We have also utilized next generation color technology and color performance. The color is completely predictable. We've, um, we have a result-driven swatch book. Our Bricado Permanent matches Demi, and then we also have a single inventory option, and I'll explain that in just a second. The first is we're brand new, brand new and we're built from the ground up. And what that means really is that although we had many opportunities to go with an existing color brand, um, for those of you who know Sam, you know that he's a formulator. And so Sam worked very closely with chemists and um, chose to use his background and his experience as a product designer to create the Bricado Color Project color system from scratch. Again, formulated by Sam Bricado, a complete hairdressing driven brand of retail, smoothing, and coloring products created by a stylist for a stylist and the health and well-being of stylists and guests mean everything to me. Let's talk a little bit about low ammonia odor because it's the combination of the amazing conditioning benefits we're going to discuss um, that Bricado products are known for, the next generation performance, and our unique LAO or low ammonia complex allows Bricado Color Project to outperform any other color brand that is out there on the market. We were also able to use German color technology in creating the color project system, although, like I mentioned earlier, it is made in the U.S. Next generation performance, or new color technology, um, provides durable, long-lasting results. The color pigments that we use in our color are smaller, and they're able to penetrate deeper within the hair shaft, and that result gives us brilliant color, amazing shine, and healthy, uncompromised hair. The next that I think is also mostly important is the fact that we also contain both the Bricado Color Project Permanent as well as the Bricado Color Project Demi contain a moisture rich base of essential oils and conditioners that actually help to improve the condition of the hair during the coloring process. And those essential oils are the Muramura seed butter, macadamia seed oil, green tea seed oil, and palm kernel oil. In addition, we have created a result-driven swatch book, and this helps with the ease of formulation. This works as both a consultation tool as well as a formulation tool for you. And the results, you'll get predictable results every single time using our swatch book. Also to note, our Bricado Color Project Demi matches Bricado Color Project Permanent exactly, level and tone throughout both systems. In addition to that, for salons that do not carry our Bricado Demi um, restorative hair color, we have two single inventory options to create Demi and semi-permanent shades out of the Bricado Permanent. And I'm going to explain that in a little bit more detail here in just a second as well. So let's talk a little bit about the cutting edge of color, and we're going to start off with Permanent and our complete system, our complete toolbox. So we have Permanent, we have Demi. We have High Lift Blonde Series. 
We have intensifiers in both the permanent and the demi line. We have powder lights and we have cream lights. And then again, we also have the single inventory option. All of these combined together is what creates the Bricado Color Project toolbox or the complete color system. Again, let's talk about permanent. And some of the benefits you have with our permanent color, again, is low ammonia odor, predictable results that match the swatch. It will completely cover gray. We use premium micro pigments, which again, guarantee long lasting results as well as, well as shine. The moisture rich base of essential oils, and then our low ammonia odor. Um, low ammonia odor has typically been the most offensive part of any color service. It, it's the smell, not the alkalizer itself. It has had a perception that it was old fashioned or it caused damage. Usually most colors that had a high amount of ammonia used a lot of strong fragrances to mask it. And then of course the lighter levels had an even stronger smell. What we have found is that the ammonia is actually the most dependable alkalizer for permanent color. It gently raises the pH to a necessary level. It rinses easily from the hair. It is stable and predictable. And unlike other alternatives, it does not um, create uneven lift or excess porosity or scalp irritation. The Bricado Low Ammonia or LAO base provides all the benefits of ammonia, but the odor is trapped in the cream. So the odor is actually decreased by 80% or more and this allows for a much more pleasant experience and a safer plus more pleasant experience and comfortable experience for the stylist as well as the guests in the salon. The Bricado Color Project Lookbook, as I mentioned, or swatch book, is a, a formulation tool. You'll notice, and I won't get into this into too much of this, um, however, just for those of you who are new and have just received your lookbook, one of the things to point out is that all of our swatches are on pigmented hair. This is how we have gained a result-driven swatch book. So all of the tens are on the underlying pigment of a 10. All of the nines you see are already on the underlying pigment of a nine. The eights are on an eight. So this gives you the result that you're going to achieve when you're using the color. So rather than having to say, okay, she's a natural level four, she wants to be a six copper, which would be a level six slash four copper in Bricado, you would then usually have to go out and figure, okay, she's a four, she wants to be a six, she's gonna pull red orange, I'm gonna use a little of this, a little of this, a little of this, and hope that you get really close to what your result is going to be. We have taken that out of the, equa the equation and made your formulation much easier. Because this is showing you the result, all you have to do is, she's a natural level four, she wants to be that six, level six, copper or 6-4, so you use simply 6-4. slash four. The color you choose is the, col the color you choose is the color you use is the color you're going to get. It makes it very, 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 very simple, easy formulation and consultation tool. In addition to that, we've also on the very back of our color swatch book or look book, we provide you with the Bricado color wheel. And some important things to note about Bricado is we have a combination of pre-blended colors which have more brown or blonde in them, as well as we also have pure tone colors which have less brown or blonde in them. And why would we do this? Well, usually when you're trying to cover gray or you need a color that is more natural looking, you want brown or blonde. But if you're trying to have a color that has the most vibrant red or copper on somebody with heavily pigmented hair, you need more pure tone because they already have brown or blonde in their hair. Or if you're looking for the most control, trying to control the most gold, copper, or red orange, I should say, or red in the hair. You need more of a pure tone shade to be able to do that. So we've been able to formulate our colors to give you a nice balance of both pre-blended and pure tone. So what you'll notice as you look at this color wheel is zero, which is natural or neutral, is found right in the center of the color wheel. All of the little dots that you see there towards the center have more brown or blonde in them, and the ones closer to the outside of the color wheel, furthest away from the natural, are more pure tone. So they have little or zero brown or blonde in them. So again, shades closest to the center of the color wheel contain more brown or blonde and are pre-blended colors. 
Shades closer to the outside are more pure tone and contain less brown or blonde. The shades are placed on the color wheel to illustrate the exact tonal contribution. We have taken the guesswork out of it. Usually when somebody says an ash is an ash, it could be anything. It could be blue, it could be violet, it could be blue-violet, it could be blue-green. We show you exactly where our ash is a blue to the green side. So makes it much easier for formulating as well as getting those predictable results that are very, very important, especially when you're in the, um, you know, when you're in the process of converting from one color line to another. Let's explain how we read our numbers and letters. The first number in front of the slash, some people call it a dash, either way, whatever you want to call it is fine. The first number in front of the slash denotes the level. As you see here, 836, a level 8. 7 slash 75 is a level 7, and 5 slash 46 is a level 5. We also use a combination of numbers and letters after the slash to denote the tone. And we do this, and we use numbers and letters because European color brands tend to use numbers because the word for copper, the word for ash, the word for violet, you know, varies from one language to another. But we've also used a letter system to make it easy for you to understand as well. So you get a little bit of both. Um, if there are two numbers behind the slash, as in what you're looking at on your screen now, it means that it is a combination of those two tones. So, for instance, an 8 slash 3, 6 is a level 8, 3 is gold, and 4, I'm mean, excuse 6 is violet. And so the first number, which is the 3 or gold, is the dominant tone. And the second number, which is the 6, is a contributing tone. That contributing tone can either enhance the dominant tone or it can subdue the dominant tone. So, for instance, an 8, 3, 6 is a level 8, two parts gold or dominant, one part violet, which is 6. And in this case, that 6 or violet softens the gold and gives you an 8 golden beige. Okay, hope that makes sense. It's kind of harder when I can't see you guys. The next one, which is a level 7 slash 7, 5, the first number is 7, which is brown. It's kind of a violet-based brown, so there's two parts of brown. And the second is 5, which is red. So in this case, it's a level 7, brown is the dominant, red is the contributing, and the red enhances the brown. So you've got a level 7, brown, red. In the case of the 5 slash 4, 6, you've got a level 5. Your dominant tone is a four, or as you can see, the letter copper. And the second number is contributing, which is six or violet. So you've got two parts copper and one part violet. What happens is that violet cools off just a little bit of that copper to give you more of a nice, true red copper shade. So in this case, it subdues, but at the same time enhances. So it gives you a really nice, um, visual as well as explanation of how our levels and tones work. Bricado color, permanent color, is mixed one part permanent color with one part of our rich cream developer. Our tubes are two ounces or 60 milliliters, whichever way you um, measure. The volume of the developer is determined by the desired amount of lift. It's best to use a scale for more accurate measuring. You'll find the viscosity of Ricardo Permanent, especially with the rich cream developer, you're going to want to use a bowl and brush application. It has a nice um, emulsifying texture once it's mixed, and it spreads very, very easy and evenly. A little bit about developer usage, since I mentioned the developer is determined by the amount of lift. If you are looking for up to one level of lift, staying the same level or going to, or a little bit deeper, then 10 volume is your optimum choice. If you're looking to lift one to two levels and you're looking for the most amount of gray coverage, then you'd want to use 20 volume. 30 volume will give you two to three levels of lift and 40 volume will give you three to four levels of lift. Mixing and processing. Our average mixing and processing I already mentioned was one to one. 
our processing time is 30 to 45 minutes. You want to make sure you're leaving it the full 45 minutes on gray hair. Gray coverage as well, the percentage of gray will determine the amount of natural series that you should use in your formulation. Remember I mentioned that our swatch book was result driven, meaning that it was already on the underlying pigment at that color. If you are working with gray or unpigmented hair, it doesn't have that underlying pigment, so we need to compensate for that. And the way we do that is, if you're anywhere from zero to 25% gray, you can simply use two ounces of whatever your desired permanent color is, plus two ounces of your rich cream developer. 20 volume would be optimum if you're looking, if you're closer to 25%. 25 to 75 percent gray, you would use one ounce or half of your formula would be your desired permanent color. The other half of your formula or one ounce would be the natural series at that same level. So for instance, if we went back to the slash, the six slash four, the level six copper, if a guest was zero to 25 percent gray, you would use two ounces of slick slash four and two ounces of 20 volume. If they were between 25 to 75 percent gray, you would use one ounce of six slash four and one ounce of six slash zero or natural plus two ounces of 20 volume. If your guests came in and they were 75 to 100 percent gray, then you would use one half ounce of your desired formula, which in, in this case is six slash four, and one and a half ounces of six slash zero plus two ounces of 20 volume developer. And then we also have a resistant gray or double pigmented formula, which I will um, share with you in just one second, next two slides. So for gray coverage, just some gray coverage tips, extend your processing time to the full 45 minutes. Try to stay within two levels of your natural level when covering gray. This works the best on, um, it just looks better on the guest as well as it will it will help you um, get achieve the best results. Use a brush application working across the hair shaft and then the multi-pigment bases sometimes make the natural series unnecessary. And that is because these shades that are listed, the slash three six, which is a golden beige, slash seven, which is a violet base brown, slash seven five, which is a brown red, slash four seven, which is a copper brown, and slash five seven, which is a red brown, all live really, really, really close to the zero on the inside of the swatch, um, on inside of the color wheel. So those actually help you with gray coverage all on their own. If you're looking to cover gray on coarse textured, tenacious, that resistant gray hair, you can use a double pigmented formula. And what's nice about using this is that you don't have to be brown. Everybody with resistant gray, and we often hear, do you have a double pigmented natural or, or do you have a double natural? Well, the truth of the matter is not all of my guests, and I'm sure not all of yours, want to just be brown when they have resistant gray. So for that reason, you can actually double pigment any formula by using um, two parts of your Bricado Color Project Permanent Color. Now again, make sure you're blending the gray or, or using the gray coverage guidelines to be sure you're using enough of the zero, but just double your formula, two parts of your color formula, plus one part of 30 volume. So what you've done is you've increased the alkalinity by using more color because your alkalinity or your ammonia is in the tube of color. And you've also increased the dye load or the amount of pigment. And that is what's needed oftentimes with that coarse textured hair because it's a, it's a fatter strand of hair and you need more pigment in there to fill it. So that's kind of the why, and that's why this works. Two parts color, one part 30 volume for coarse, textured, tenacious, resistant gray. Here's how the Bricado Tonal series works. Zero is natural. One is a natural ash, or one NA, I should say. One slash A is our ash. Two M is matte or green. Three is gold. Three six is golden beige. Seven one is a brown ash. Seven three is a brown gold. Seven is a brown. Seven five brown violet. Seven seven is a brown brown. It's beautiful. It's just a nice, beautiful, rich brown color. 
um, four three copper gold, four is copper, four four is a double copper or copper copper, four five copper red, four six copper violet, four seven is copper brown, five is red, five five is obviously red red, five six is red violet, five seven red brown, six is violet, eight is violet, and nine is a violet base blue. So this gives you a little bit, you know, when you're looking at the tonal series because you will always have the number and the letter next to each other. We also have a high lift blonde series and these are available in seven shades and our high lift blondes will provide three to four levels of lift and these are mixed two parts 30 or 40 volume. So one part high lift with two parts of 30 volume for up to three levels of lift or two parts of 40 volume for up to four levels of lift. Processing time is 45 to 60 minutes, and I highly recommend that you leave it on the full time. If the hair has already been previously colored, you do not want to pull this through the ends. You want to color balance with our Ricardo Color Project Demi Color. We also have five intensifiers, and these can be mixed with any of the permanent colors to intensify or subdue your formula. They are pure tone for ultimate creativity and versatility, and we have permanent intensifiers for permanent colors. Now these can also be mixed with developers and used alone on pre-lightened or blonde hair. One thing to remember is it does have a little bit of ammonia in it, so we also have intensifiers in our demi, which in doing some of these funky creative hair colors might be a better option, but you can use the permanent if that's all that you had to use. Here is a little bit more information on our single inventory option and how you can create a gentle semi-permanent color by using Bricado Permanent, the tubes of permanent. And the way that you would do that is you mix one part of permanent color, one part of our zero slash zero clear, which is found in our demi um, category, as well as one part of demi activating cream. What you've done is you've actually reduced the alkalinity or the ammonia content by using more of the zero zero clear and activating cream which by the way the activating cream is only 7.5 volume so and then you've also made a color that's a little bit more translucent because you've used a little bit less of the color so it creates a nice gentle semi-permanent color option if you're looking for a more durable demi then you would still use one part permanent but instead you you would use one part perfectly clear because this actually contains an, a very mild alkalizer called AMP which still dilutes your ammonia content and one part activating cream at 7.5 volume. So this would give you more of a durable demi by using the Bricado Permanent Color if that's all you had. So just gives you a little bit of options as far as your inventory goes. Formulation guidelines are very simple. Determine the natural level, analyze the percentage of gray because this will determine your developer as well as determine des the desired color result and choose the most gentlest formula that will help you achieve your result. Gary, I'm going to turn this over now to Gary to walk through Demi Permanent. Hi everybody, it's great to be with you and um, I have the opportunity of sharing our companion color to our permanent color system, which is our demi-permanent color system. We actually created Bricado permanent color and Bricado demi-permanent color to stand alone in the salon by themselves, but they also work intermixably and interchangeably, and you'll see in this section how they blend together and can be used together. The Bricado de Color Project Demi has a special micro pigment it guarantees long-lasting, predictable results. It deposits color in the hair. It actually oxidizes the color in the hair. But because we use an ammonia-free alkalizer, amino methyl propanol, it gives absolutely no lift to the result. The, the thing that, per, that causes the lift is alkalization of the developer. And because of AMP is our alkalizer, it makes it so that there's just no way we can lift and lighten the hair. Demi-permanent color is excellent for blending gray. It will almost cover gray, but it doesn't cover it durably. It fades out of the hair really evenly, so we always will say that it blends gray. It's non-progressive, which means that it doesn't get darker. If you apply demi-color to the hair and leave it for 20 minutes and then match it against a head that you apply and leave on for an hour, 
you can see that the color looks the same. It doesn't matter how long it's left on. Obviously, we don't want to leave it on longer than is prescribed, but it doesn't get repeatedly darker. The formula is created to not to prevent damage to the hair and to be very, very nice to the hair. The idea is that you want to be able to layer demicolor on, on fresh texturized hair or freshly smooth hair over the top of freshly colored hair, as well as clients who just only need a demi-refreshing shade. So it's designed to prevent damage. One of the things that you'll notice differently when you apply Bricado Demi-Color is that as you rinse it from the hair, the hair is completely detangled, the hair is totally smooth. You can run your fingers right through the hair without need of conditioner. And that's just a testimony of how gentle our alkalizing agent is, as well as, well as the complex of moisturizers and essential oils, the same ones that we find in the permanent color are also found in the demi-color. And then the last thing, the last feature that's important to us is Bricotta Color Project Demi-Color does match the permanent color. So we have one swatch book that works for both, and then we have a second swatch book that only covers the demi-shades. This is our demi-look book, and it's designed for salons that only carry the demi-color, as well as a, being a retail tool for salons that are using our color refreshing system we'll talk about in a minute. You'll see that the, seven, the shades are, are organized into three major families, naturals and golds, coppers and reds, and blue violets and browns, rather than being divided up into so many different categories as we would with a complete permanent system. By blending demi colors together, you can get to almost any permanent color type formula that you would find in the regular permanent color book. Um, some of the ways to use demi-color, and I think that's really where the, the rubber hits the roads, is what are the things that you can do with demi-color? Well, the first way to apply, to understand about demi to begin with, is because there's no lightning, there's no lifting action, you'll always be staying at the same level that you started at, or going darker. But you're overlaying color over the top of what you have. So if you start out with a brown, you could use a very bright red demi-color and create a red-brown. If you started out with a blonde and used a bright red demi-color, you'd create an extremely bright red, as you may have seen in one of our photos that we show. But remember that you're going at the level you started, or you're going to go darker and richer. Um, the first place that we use demi-color is it's a perfect choice for a color-shy guest. If you have a guest in the salon who's not sure about coloring their hair, possibly because of age, sometimes when you have young girls in the salon and their mothers are more concerned about them coloring their hair than they are, or you have someone who's never colored their hair before and they're just not quite sure, Demi-Color gives you the option of creating a formula for them that's going to last for three to six weeks. By the time they come back for their next haircut, it'll be completely gone from their hair, and they'll be able to decide if they want to use something more aggressive the next time. Because you used a Bricado Demi formula, the formulation that you created for that Demi client is easily transported to a permanent formula because the numbers and the, and the shades are the same. Another thing we do with Demi is we enhance the natural color or the natural tone. Um, oftentimes, this is great for brunettes. People come to the salon and their hair just looks tired. Um, sometimes the guest comes in and says, oh, I don't do anything to my hair. And I want to say, yeah, I can tell. The ends are faded and kind of tired looking, kind of gold or brassy, or they've, taken, they've lost life and health. And we can just enhance that natural tone. They're a natural brunette, and we just do a brunette Demi over the top or a, or a gold Demi over the top. Another way of using demi is with a glaze. Here's our fiery redhead that I told you about. A glaze is any time you apply color over the top of a permanent color service. A glaze can be used a couple of different ways. It can enhance the tonality of your result, or it can tone down or refine the tonality of the result if you've applied permanent color. The interesting thing about glazing is it's also a great option in the salon as a ticket builder to increase the revenue for the salon. You can have a premium or prestige level color service just by doing a demi glaze over the top of your permanent color service. It'll add shine, it'll enhance the depth and the richness of the color, and also allow you to add um, some, some well needed, well earned dollars to the ticket. Maybe you can add even 20, even 30, or 40 dollars to that ticket just by doing this additional service for a few minutes. Um, we use demi color as a toner. Because when you bleach the hair, you're introducing highly alkaline products, you're removing the pigment from the hair. There's no need to use a permanent color to tone bleached hair. All we need to do is deposit tonality or change the color that we visually see in the hair. And so Demi is a great way of creating a very lightweight toner and very quickly, in just, in just 10 or 15 minutes, getting the tonality that you need and controlling 
unwanted warmth or adding a little bit more gold, depending upon what direction you're going, where the, where the tone of the blonde is concerned. The next, the next one really is about a client. Um, Demi is our favorite product to use on men, both for two purposes, either for blending and covering and naturalizing gray hair, also for enriching and beautifying, beautifying is not a good word for guys, enriching and masculinizing their, masculinizing their hair color tone. Um, but the best part about Demi is because there is no lift, especially on darker hair faces, one of the scariest things for men is getting permanent color and then they spend some time at the golf course or they go outside um, and work in the yard or maybe their, their uh, employment is outside and as their hair starts to fade or their hair starts to lighten, the brassiness that is common as an undertone of permanently colored hair starts to come through. It looks much more unnatural on men than it does on women. We're kind of used to it on women. So if I use demi color on men, I'm guaranteed that there'll be no unwanted warmth, there'll be no regrowth line, and I'll have a soft transition from the, the younger, more youthful, more, more strong result that I created and the slow, slow process of the color fading. It's a great way to introduce men to hair color services. Demi is a great tool for low lighting, same as toning a bleach, because we remember um, I've already lightened and lifted the color from the hair. There's no reason to go in with a permanent chemistry and add more chemicals to the hair than it needs. Some of the most common low lighting techniques that are out now are people are doing ombre and coloring the ends of the hair, either bright, vibrant colors or nice, natural, deep, rich brown colors. If there's previously been lightened, low lighting is really easy to do with demi color. It's quick to use in a liquid form and it gives you a, a great result in just 20 minutes. It's just depositing color into the hair. We also use Demi to blend gray. I talked a minute ago, formula-wise, Demi color often looks as if it's completely covering gray. But we always talk about gray blending because over the course of two or, or maybe three weeks, the color will begin to fade. It will begin to leave the hair as it is designed to do. And someone who's trying to cover gray hair isn't really interested in having that coverage go away. So we always talk to them about we can blend the gray and give you a more youthful result. We can even reduce the gray by weaving the, the um, demi color into the hair rather than covering their entire head would be another option of making the gray go away. Color balancing is a technique that we use as part of a permanent color service. Many times what happens with permanent color is the most vibrant tonality, such as a bright red that you see here, often a rich deep brown and sometimes even cooler tones or gold tones the ends of the hair start to lose life and lose vibrance, especially if someone is blowing their hair dry or flat ironing often, or they have a lot of length in their hair. The hairs past their shoulders, usually the ends of their hair start to look a little bit distressed at the end of a four to six week color cycle. And so what we do with Demi Color is we go in and touch up the new growth with the regular permanent formula that we've been using, rather than putting the alkalinity and the chemistry in a permanent color through the ends of hair that's already been colored, we use a demi-color formula on the ends. It's much more healthy for the hair. It helps preserve the, the hair fiber. It also really, in the long run, brings fadage nearly to a complete halt, so it becomes almost unnecessary. But we use demi-color on the ends of the hair rather than putting a, a more aggressive permanent formula on the ends after we're doing a color service. Our demi-color is also our product of choice when it comes to repigmenting the hair. Repigmenting the hair is part of the color correction process. And we all know as you lift and lighten the hair and remove warmth from the hair, it becomes necessary, if I want to go darker again, it becomes necessary to put that warmth or put, build that warmth back into the hair. There's a couple of different ways to do that. One of the ways is to add something warm to the bowl, but we've discovered that isn't as predictable and doesn't work as naturally. So what we've done is we've created a repigmentation chart, and this gives you a suggestion of exactly which demi shade you need to use to put the pigment back into the hair. And we mix the, the color listed. For example, if I've had someone with extreme highlights, they've been very, very blonde, and they just wanna go back to their normal level six brown, then I would look at the chart. My target level is a level six dark blonde. The pigment that's needed in the hair is red pigment, and it's more of a red orange tone. So our recommended Bricado Demi is 743 or seven copper gold. I'd mix seven copper gold with equal parts of water, so an ounce of seven copper gold and an ounce of water, and I'd apply that through the entire head. 
leave it for just a couple of minutes and then use a paper towel to blot and remove as much of that color from the hair as you can. What happens is that the repigmatizing formula um, deposits and penetrates into the hair that's most porous. Coincidentally, the hair that's most porous is also the hair that's been highlighted or the hair that's most blonde. And so then when I go, after I've blotted out as much of the repigmatizer as possible, I go back with my final formula, which in this case might be um, 6-0 or 6-N permanent color. I apply that right over the top of my formula. Where the hair was the most blonde and the most porous, it has a base of copper gold that will prevent the natural permanent color from going too ash or unnatural. Where there's no porosity and the hair still has its natural pigment, the natural lift will provide that warmth and you'll get an even result from scalp to ends in just maybe five more minutes time. It's a phenomenal technique. It also works inside of foils. If you're weaving and you want to do low lights, extreme highlights, repigmatizing would be something that you want to do there. Kick back one, Michelle. I think we missed. There we go. The mixing instructions for demi um, permanent color is we mix with equal parts of activating liquid. Um, we also have a tool for diluting the demi color. There's two tools actually. The first one is perfectly clear, and you can have a maximum dilution. You can use it full strength, obviously, but if you're concerned about too much intensity, then you can add a diluter. Um, we use perfectly clear. And you mix that in thirds or in equal parts or two thirds of clear with one third of color in your formula to create a different richness or depth within the color. Um, there's two versions of clear. The first one is perfectly clear. Perfectly clear is designed to mix with our demi color. It lightens and dilutes the formula. It's the actual consistency is the same, and the product in the bottle is identical. It's demi color with no pigment. It contains a little bit of alkalinity with AMP and it helps you maintain the viscosity of your final formula. Um, some of the competitors also have clear products and they use them for creating shine or creating enhancing the shine or glazing or sealing hair color. Um, it's common sometimes to use a clear demi permanent color for that, but we have a special product that's designed just to be a sealer and a color sealer. Zero, zero clear is designed for neutralizing curl interrupted. It contains no, um, no AMP, no amino methylpropanol, so it has a pH of 4.5. You can use it with or without the activating liquid. You can also add actives restorative hair infusion if you want to um, punch up the shine and the intensity. And you can even use zero, zero clear by itself. Just let it process in the hair and it will give you, it will seal the color in, help smooth the cuticle, and give you a glazer finish to the hair that gives you the same gloss as a demi-permanent color, but it doesn't create porosity. Um, there's five shades of demi-color that we identify as shears, and these are designed specifically to be toners or glosses. They're fantastic to use after highlights. They're fantastic to use on blondes. Each of the five is designed to address the very, very palest, lightest blonde shades. So you'll notice if you look up at the top, um, 907, 937, are both a level nine shade. Zero seven is a natural brown. Three seven is a golden beige. And then the level 10 shades are 10 three, 10 zero, and 10 three four. 10 three or 10 G is a very pale, pale gold. 10 zero or 10 N is a very pale, soft natural. And 10 G C or three four is a golden copper. That's just a little bit of richness, a little bit of, a little bit of warmth to the, to the result. Um, Michelle talked a little bit about the intensifiers previously um, and what happens with intensifiers in a permanent world, intensifiers punch up the tonality. In a demi-permanent world, they punch up the tonality or they can use all alone to create really intense fashion shades within the hair. We just recommend that if you're mixing with the demi formula, use demi intensifiers. If you're mixing a permanent formula, use permanent intensifiers. But our intensifiers are designed to give you the color of the swatch. So if you have bleach blonde hair, and you apply 044 copper intensifier mixed with activator, the hair will be 044 copper orange. It'll be as orange as you can make it, or with 55 as red as you can make it, with 11 as blue as you can make it. They're very, very intense. So it's not just designed to mix with other shades, but it's also designed to be used by themselves to create wild and crazy shades. My daughter, I know, wanted pink highlights a couple of months ago, and we created pink highlights 
with four parts of perfectly clear and one part of 055. And it lasted for about six weeks and she had pink streaks and, and really had a fun time with it. Coming into breast cancer, that might be breast cancer awareness. That might be something fun to offer in the salon is pink highlights or pink tones for people who are, who are wanting to participate and identify and celebrate um, the, the time when we're, when we're being aware of breast cancer. To blend gray with demicolor, it's important that we include a level or a, or a quantity of natural series in the formula. Anytime you're covering gray hair, you're covering hair with no natural pigment. And when it has no natural pigment, we need to add natural back into our formula. So if the client has zero to 25% gray, then I would create my, my demi-permanent color with two ounces of color and two ounces of activating lotion, activating liquid. If they had 25 to 75% gray, I'd mix 50-50, one ounce of bricado color with one ounce of natural series, um, demi-color, and then two ounces of activating liquid. If they had 75% gray or more, I'd use a half an ounce of bricado color mixed with one and a half ounces of natural um, series and the two ounces of activating liquid. The amount of gray determines how much natural you put in the bowl. Demi-color processes for 20 to 30 minutes. It can be processed with or without heat. If you use heat, it processes a little bit more quickly, but the result still is the same as if you processed at room temperature. So if you processed with heat for 15 minutes, it would be the same as 20 minutes at room temperature. Um, in any case, we take it off after 30 minutes by rinsing thoroughly and then conditioning the hair. After demi-color is completed, we don't shampoo the hair. Um, now, Color Refresher, um, we alluded to Color Refresher a couple of minutes ago. Color Refresher is our custom formulated color extender. It helps us create color that lasts longer, gives a take-home product to the guest that was especially formulated just for them to help them refresh and help them enhance the color service they're receiving in the salon. We, we match the Color Refresher right to the Bricado Color Formula. So what happens is to create a Color Refresher for our guest, all we do is we mix a demi-color with constructor deep reconditioner. It deposits, in, it only deposits color in the hair. It doesn't lift or lighten the hair. It doesn't even really cover gray. It just increases the tonal uh, qualities of the hair. So, and it doesn't stain anything. Michelle's follow, doing a good job of following me with slides. Um, so how am I gonna mix it? I'm gonna take one ounce of Color Project demi-color and four ounces of constructor. We actually have a bottle that's designed for that, color refresher bottles. And these retail in the salon for $16.95. The cost to the hairdresser is about one third of that. So it has a very good margin. What you need to get, send the guest home with is you let them know that they need to cleanse their hair first with appropriate Bricado shampoo, then apply the color refresher and leave it on for, for one to five minutes. The finished mixture is five ounces, of, five ounces of refresher. That's enough to last them at home in the, in the shower That'll last them for four to six weeks, which is about how much time we want them um, between color services in the salon. The reason we want them to run out is if I send them home with bright red color refresher, and then they come back to the salon and I give them blonde highlights, I don't want them using red color refresher on top of their fresh front highlights. They need to get a new color refresher that's designed for that situation. Here's the pricing. The salon cost is $373 to $648, depending upon um, how much, how much demi-color you use. 648 is how much it costs for one ounce of demi-color, the constructor in the bottle. And you retail it for $16.95. So it's a great, it's a great margin for you. The other thing we do with color refreshers, it makes a great out on retail opportunity. It's something else they need. It doesn't compete with anything you're using in the salon. It's also a great referral or retention gift. Sometimes people offer a color guarantee for only $10 more, we can guarantee your hair color and they include the color refresher. Run that as a promotion. And then after they've been using color refresher for a while, they come back and they purchase it. And in a sense, you've raised the price or increased the price of your hair color. So that's the, the color um, parts of our um, permanent and demi-permanent color. It's important to understand when you use demi-permanent and, and permanent color together. Uh, the real secret is, is to determine when you use one or the other. In general, it's simple. Anytime you want to be the same level, go darker or stay the same level and change the tonality, then demi-color is the perfect tool for you. There's no reason to lift and lighten the hair if you don't need a result that's lighter when you're done. Um, you use permanent color anytime you want to go lighter or brighter than the, than the color that you see when the guest comes in. 
If it's necessary, if lifting or lightening is necessary, you must use permanent color. If 100% gray coverage is necessary, then you use permanent color. For the brightest redheads and the, and the blondest, clearest blondes, we'll use permanent color. But any other time, demi-color is great. It's a perfect solution. Demi-color helps you avoid chemicals that aren't necessary in the hair. It doesn't create remaining color in the hair or underlying warmth, and that makes it so much easier to do color correction or to transfer the client from choice A to choice B to choice C. Demi will fade evenly back to the starting color, and it's very predictable for color correction. And we also talked about using demi color as a toner. That's part of a double process system. And in all the study we've done and all the research we've done to create absolutely perfect results, perfect world class color, double process is a great tool. And demi is a really important part of that, which really leads us right into our blonding and lightening processes. We have two different, two different uh, products in the, in, that we use for lightening, but they're all built around creating the most updated techniques and, and techniques that, that we're all aware of. Foil highlights are, are something that we use constantly in the salons, doing foiling and adding, placing perfect highlights. Ombre is the idea of having the ends a little bit deeper and darker than the new growth area. Double process blonding is that bright Madonna blonde or Marilyn Monroe blonde or Lady Gaga blonde, depending on what color their hair is this week. Um, and then uh, balayage is the idea of hand painting and placing the highlights on a strand by strand basis without using foil. And then of course, sometimes our lights are used for corrective color. If the guest has their hair too dark, if they've got too much pigment in their hair, then it's time to take a step back and say, whoa, we need to start again and cleanse the palette. And so we use Bricado Color Project lights for correcting color as well. Our first lightener is the, is the most gentle solution or the most gentle option. Cream Lights is designed specifically for balayage techniques or freehand highlighting techniques. It's because it's extremely thick. It allows you to have perfect placement to put the color exactly where you want. It can be used on or off the scalp, and it doesn't run or imprint on the surrounding hair. It's, it's our favorite balayage tool. Um, Cream Lights is full of essential oils that protect the hair, but another thing the essential oils do is the essential oils make Cream Lights so that it is shampoo soluble but not water soluble. So what that allows you to do is it allows you to layer cream lights with other products. Um, we mix cream lights with two parts of rich cream developer. 10 or 20 volume can be used on the scalp. 10, 20, 30, or 40 volume can be used off the scalp. And our expectation is that you would get two to five levels of lift, depending upon how light the hair is when you start. Cream lights will work for about 60 minutes, and then it's gently shampooed from the hair. But think for just a minute about having a lightener that's not shampoo, that's not water soluble. What that allows you to do is to put cream lights on pieces of the hair in a balayage technique, or maybe to set up the ends of the hair for an ombre technique. And then you can apply demi-color over the rest of the head. Demi-color can go right over the hair strands that have cream lights on them. And because cream lights is not soluble, it won't go through the cream lights. The hair will continue to lighten and the hair will continue to lift. Well, then when I get to the shampoo ball, I have one of two choices. If I rinse the hair, I can remove all of the, all of the demi-color formula and the cream light strands are protected. Then adds a little bit of shampoo, the cream lights will break down and all of a sudden I've got dramatic highlights next to my new color that I deposited with demi-color. On the other hand, if I wanna to tone and soften those highlights, before I rinse all of my demi-color, I can add a little bit of shampoo to my head and lather and massage it up and the cream lights will start to break down, the demi-color will start to bleed through and will start to color and, and influence the highlighted portions of the hair. So it depends how dramatic you wanna be, you can color it right on top of each other. This photo of balayage is a very, very subtle, soft balayage photo. And so that's an example of using cream lights after. If you look at the pieces on the bottom of this longer dark head, you can see that we didn't do much blending on this ombre client around the bottom, around her her um, throat and around her decolletage, that was protected when we were rinsing the darker shade off because we didn't want it to, it, to, it to influence. Our powder bleach is called Powder Lights. And Powder Lights is a gentle blue lightener. It's designed to be an all-purpose lightener. It's great for all techniques. It can be used on or off the scalp. It has a very soft, fresh fragrance, and it has the same replenishing oils um, as the other color systems. And in addition, we also have collagen that helps to protect the hair and nourish the hair, helping it actually feel as nice and as good as the hair does 
after 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 it's been lightened it feels even better sometimes than it had before you'd started with you started with powder lights we mix powder lights the same as we mixed um cream lights powder lights is mixed two to one two parts of developer with one part of one part of powder lights and the blue base is really soft and helps control unwanted warmth it will also work for 60 minutes and it will lift up to seven levels very very naturally and very softly the thing to be aware of about powder lights is sometimes the consistency can be deceiving and sometimes in a rush we start to mix our bleach by just pouring things together well if you start pouring things together you'll discover that powder lights by the time you get back to the bowl is much thicker than you thought it should be. It will start to thicken up over time. Make sure that you measure correctly. And if you measure um, two parts of developer with one part of powder lights, then you'll always get a consistent lift and lightning action every time that you use it. With powder lights or with cream lights, you can also add heat if you choose to. Just need to watch the hair and make sure that you're lifting evenly and getting the result that you were looking for. A um, little bit about Vibracolor. Vibracolor is our color protection product line. There are five products, shampoo, conditioner, and treatment, obviously used in the shower. And then um, Versafix, which is our um, color protecting spray gel, and Vibracolor Fire and Ice, which is a fade prevent serum. Um, the, the reason we have styling products in the Vibracolor category is because these products are left in the hair. And really the strongest influence of color protection are things that we can leave behind or leave in the hair. The entire system is paraben and sulfate free and contains our color stability complex as well as sunscreen type triplex blend that features um, heliogenol which is sunflower seed extract to stop oxidation and we also have a moisture complex especially in the vibracolor treatment um, you can have beautifully colored hair that's not fading but if the hair looks dry and the hair looks looks um, unhealthy then the color doesn't look its very very best and so we want it to moisturize the hair and help the hair look very very rich and very healthy um, these two Vibracolor promotions are available ongoing. We have two boxes, one's Vibracolor Basics and one's Vibracolor Extras. And they're prepackaged. They're always available for you to purchase in your salon. They're a great add-on service um, at 27% offered, 33% savings, and then a 36% savings for Vibracolor Extras. So these are something you might want to keep on the shelf all the time so that you can let the guests know that you have something for their color-treated hair even add it to their service and uh, include this as part of a promotion in the salon. Michelle? Yes, I was just changing the screen. <laughs> Next, we want to talk just a little bit about the Beautiful Business Network, um, which is our rewards program, our Ricardo Rewards program. And the Beautiful Business Network, it's actually more than a rewards program. I mean, it's really designed to empower you to grow every facet of the salon business. We actually have BBN webinars monthly, and the first one that we have, the one we have coming up next is actually on September 11th, and we hold them twice a day, so twice on that day. It's usually the first Tuesday of the month, and you will be able to find, more, we'll actually send you information on that webinar and invitation to that. The BBN webinars, because it's based on a business focus, is designed really for salon owners and managers, and it does use product, but it really focuses on helping you grow your business in the salon, whether it be retention, retail, um, services, all of those types of things. So it has a product feel to it, but yet it also, like I said, has a huge focus on business. So what we do is we actually um, use your quarterly purchases of Bricado, and there's four different, well actually five different levels. And so there's a dollar amount um, that puts you within a category for the year, and you earn points depending on the different types of Bricado products or the different regimens that you carry within your salon. And the first one is bronze, and that's a minimum purchase of about $500 a quarter, which will earn you about $500, 500 points. And what you're doing is you're earning one point for every dollar you spend on any of your Bricado products. A silver level earns one point for every dollar spent on Bricado retail products, but earns two points um, for every dollar spent on color and smoothing. So as you see, if you're carrying retail and now also carrying color or smoothing, you're actually earning two points as opposed to one on your service um, products. A gold level BBN salon earns one point for dollar spent on Bricado retail products, two points for every dollar spent on color or smoothing, 
or three points for every dollar spent on color and smoothing. So again, you can see as you have a little bit, you move a little bit deeper with retail smoothing and color, you start to earn more points and they add up quick. A platinum level salon earns two points for every dollar spent on retail products, three points for every dollar spent on color or smoothing, or four points if you carry color and smoothing. And then we also have a diamond level salon, which is a salon that carries nothing but Bricado. They carry Bricado retail and no other retail, Bricado color, no other type of Bricado color or any other type of color. And they actually earn 25% more points than the silver, gold, and platinum levels on top of that. So what can you use your points for? There's quite a few things that you can use it for to help grow your business. And one of them is back bar, styling products to refill your styling products. You can also use them for sample sizes if you want to get put together a program um, as a mailer, use postcards or bring back color guests or gift with purchase or, or things of that nature. There's also salon tools like smocks and capes and color bowls and keys and um, our signature brushes and different things like that. And then you can also use your points for education. You can use it for our academy in New York, which I'll mention here in just a few minutes, as well as to be able to bring an artist in um, to your salon. So one of our creative design team members into your salon. Here's how you can specifically use it for color though. You can use it as far as the demi um, regimen or, or line is concerned. You can use it for the zero, zero clear intensity diluter swatch books if you need an extra swatch book you can use it for the color refresher bottles as well as the liter size of constructor that you need with your color refresher it does not include the color but includes a lot of the other tools within our demi line except for that with permanent color again it does not include the tubes of color but you can use it for your tube leeches so whether you're using it for cream lights or powder lights as well as developers you can also use it for um, liter sizes of the Vibracolor line as well as bowls, brushes, beakers, tube keys, and um, uh, lookbooks as well. So let's talk, for those of you who this is new, new information um, about our color line, there's a couple of different ways that you can um, bring in intros. One is a $5.99 intro that actually has a little bit of everything. It has 75 shades of permanent, all of your developers, cream lights, powder lights, as well as 31 shades of demi color, perfectly clear activators, bowls, brush, bottles, and DVD and the complete um, swatch book. So this is your, gives you a little bit of everything or what we call our Bricado Color Project complete color intro. If you want to just go with permanent, we have permanent at $2.99 and you get 40 shades of permanent, all your developers, um, your powder lights, brush, bowl, beaker, tube, um, the instructions of course, your look book or your swatch book as well. And then we also have just one for demi. So if you're a demi salon looking to bring in permanent or vice versa, permanent now looking to bring in demi, the demi kit includes 20 of the demi shades your Demi Clear Activating Liquid Cream Lights Developers, 16 ounce developer, 20 volume, another DVD bottles, and then of course the Demi Lookbook. So just to give you an idea, a little bit of a little bit of everything. Also, since we're in July and August, for those of you who are have our color already, in our July August, which ends at the end of this week, we have also been offering buy two get one with both our Bricado color permanent as well as our demi color. So make sure you take advantage of that. That ends at the end of this week. Going into our next promotional cycle, which is September, October, we have another color promotion. And that is if you purchase six Bricado permanent colors, permanent colors, you will get a free Bricado color cape. And these are really nice and thick and the neck fits just about everybody. I mean, it's just a really nice heavy duty color cape as well as if you purchase eight of the Bricado Demi colors, you will get a free apron. So we have gift with purchases that are running throughout September and October, and we like to do a color promotion, you know, every promotional cycle that we can. So this is just to give you guys an idea of what we have coming up as well as what is ending at the end of the week. Some of our um, beautiful business network um, online resources or some areas where you can gain additional information is our Bricado website 
or our 800 number, which is 800-243-0275. That's usually our hotline number as well. So if you need more information, um, then they can help direct you to where you can find the information you're looking for with our 800 number. Our Bricado Today website looks like this, and this is the very um, home page. And anybody can get to this home page, meaning whether you're a stylist or whether you're a salon owner or well, whether you're a customer. So what we've done is you actually have to create a username and password to get you to the professional part of the site. But either way, just on this site, these things um, that you see where it says Smoothing 2.0, you can see the permanent. These actually slide, and you can click on each one of those to get more information. Below that, you'll see Curl Karma, Peppermint Scrub, Saturate. Those are some of our retail regimens or shampoo and conditioning regimens. You can click on those and get more information on those products or product information sheets. To the right, where you see Bricado and the little squares, those are YouTube videos. So you can click on YouTube videos. Some of them have Sam. Actually, most of them have Sam in there talking about either product or um, smoothing or color or a lot of different things. So you can actually click through our whole library of um, YouTube videos as well. However, once you've created a username and get access to the professional part of the site, you can actually go to, I thought I had another slide there, what's called salon support. You guys can see where my arrow is hitting this file here called salon support. Salon support actually takes you to an area that has promotional information. It also leads you to an area, a file or a folder that contains salon signage. So if you're looking for posters or promotional signage or you know, um, uh, shelf talkers or anything like that, we have that under salon support as well as we have things to help you market and merchandise your salon, which would be postcards for color, for smoothing, for cutting, for retail. So we have a lot of different things just in that one folder. So make sure that you go on, create a username, create a password, and just know that it takes at least sometimes 24 hours for us to kick back your password because we have to you know, double check and make sure you're a professional to get you um, to the next part of the site. So just be patient, but once you get there, there's a ton of information on the other side that you can utilize to help grow your business in the salon. And we often, often feature these items during our BBN webinars as well. We also have our Bricado Facebook page. And on our Facebook page, we also have color smoothing retail information. So if you're looking for more information, it's a great place to ask questions. We have a lot of interaction on our Facebook page. So please, I obviously, you guys, most of you probably registered on our Facebook page, so thank you. And then, like I mentioned, we also have straight YouTube videos where you can go on YouTube, put in Bricado or San Bricado, and you will come up with a whole library, a nice long list of a lot of different videos that we have on YouTube. And here's one of them, which is the new vision in color. We also, as I mentioned with the promotional um, intros, we also have DVDs that come with those. And these DVDs are nice because they're great educational pieces for your stylist, but they're also something if you have a TV or a monitor in your salon that they're safe to loop um, for your guests to watch as well. There's no pricing or anything like that in there, so it's perfectly safe for your guests to watch those. And then lastly, one of the last things I'll mention is we do have an academy Coming up, we, we do four academies every year, and the academy is held in San Bricado Salon in Soho in New York. And we've been featuring the multiplane cutting, which Bricado is known for, and this year we added multiplane color. And we actually have our last academy coming up on October 21st and 22nd. It's a $550 tuition, or um, you can use your BBN points, and your BBN points are $16,500 for one tuition and then we usually work with you and help you find hotel um, as well close by um, we work with a lot of hotels to find you know great or reasonable rates to make it easier for you so it is a two-day event with Sam and his design team focusing on multiplane cutting and color and like I said the last one's coming up here in a couple of weeks so if you're interested please call our office and we will make sure we can we get you signed up right away and here is a little picture of outside of San Bricado Salon. And that really takes us to the end, and we're actually running a little early for a change um, for our webinar. So I would, I'm going to kick this back to Gary, Marty, and I think Sam might be listening if any of you guys would like to add more information um, 
now that we've, we're, we're closing here. Thanks, Michelle. I think this was great. Um, we appreciate the time that everybody's taken to be here. I've answered some questions uh, over the over the course of the uh, the webinar, and I think I'll just run through them and give you the answers that that came. Um, a man asked if we have a zero one series, and within our color system, we do not have a dedicated zero one series. But one of the things that Michelle talked about when she was talking about this series is the numbers after the slash equal the tonality. And so zero one, the tonality would be a natural ash. And the way that I could create a zero one series would be to mix two parts of a natural with one part of an ash. And that would create a zero one at any tonality I'm looking for. So if there's a tone or, or a shade you're thinking you'd like to see that doesn't exist, maybe a golden red or a golden copper, um, you can create that by mixing uh, intermixing shades together. And and I send Amanda an answer and said, yeah, here's how you'd make it. Um, Mike asked uh, if it's possible to repigmatize the hair with permanent color instead of with demi-color. And yes, it is possible. The challenge that we have repigmatizing hair with permanent color is that the formulation of permanent color allows for warmth in the hair. And so actually the tonality of a permanent formula is a little bit cooler than you might expect because the warmth should be added from the air. So if you need to use permanent color for repigmentation, then you need to create your repigmentation formula using the intensifiers. So I'd use 033 and 044. But you know, for ease of use and for simplicity, it only takes four different shades of demi-permanent color to create a full palette of, of uh, the full palette of everything you need for color correction. So I'd bring in one bottle of each of those four shades, and now you're ready to repigmatize and and uh, work successfully with that repigmatizing system. Um, Fabian, I feel for you. Fabian's down in Florida, and he he sent a message, and he said, "Unfortunately, as a result of of Isaac, they've had storms and the signals breaking up." And I did let Fabian know that all of our webinars are recorded, and after the webinar is over, we um, Create a we create a link to that recording and we send it out to everyone that registered. So you, in your follow up email, you'll get a link so that you can download and watch the webinar again um, at, on your own time and, and study the parts that you may have missed. Uh, but we feel for everybody down in Florida. We hope you guys are okay. It's an important important group of salons down there. Some good friends are in Florida. Um, Ronald asks if you can pick your own colors for the intro promotions. Yes, you can. You can pick your own colors, or we can. We have a pre-selected mix of colors, so whichever one works best for your salon, um, check with your distributor and let us know. Um, Luke wants to know if we'll be creating a one zero series or a stroke eight eight series anytime soon. Um, I haven't thought about those, but we'll write those down. Um, right now, two zero and really two zero one is the darkest that we get, and. Uh, Two two oh one is a dark blue is a dark blue black, and um, we'll look at those tonalities and see if there's something that that uh, makes sense that for people and they're looking for. Amanda sent me a thank you note, and David wants to know if the webinar if the networkers will receive the PowerPoint in the webinar. Absolutely, David, you can have anything we've got. Um, we want to thank you all for being here. If anybody else has got any questions, um, type them in. It's it with so many people on the line. We can't turn the mics on and have everybody talk at the same time. It's complete bedlam and craziness. But um, I'll stay on for a little while and answer typed messages for you. Um, with that, Michelle, anything else you want to share? I just want to say thank you all for um, attending and hanging out with us for a little over an hour. And um, if there's anything that, that we can do, just let us know. We'd be more than happy to help you. Thanks, guys. And, and I'll be on for a few minutes and type responses for you. We appreciate your time and hope you enjoyed learning about the Bricado uh, color system. And we'll make sure that you get a copy of the webinar so you can uh, watch it again on your own. Bye-bye and have a great day. Those of you that are in the Southeast, batten the hatches and hang on. And uh, we wish you all the best. Thanks, everybody.